happy, y'all. So I'm at Ozone Falls. Let's go check this waterfall out. At least the path's been walked on, so it's not too snowy. So pretty out here. Look at the icicles. Look how deep. Okay, so here we are going up the mountain and the last time I was in my Dodge journey when it snowed and I had a bit of a, a difficulty. So yeah, but now I have a Wrangler and I have this in four wheel drive and as you can see, we're going up the mountain here over up to the scenic overlook and there were some deer that jumped across and I can't remember where they were, but they were right up through here somewhere. But I got up here fairly well. And then as we get up around the corner here, there is some um, people that'll be passing us soon. My Wrangler was a pro, like, oh, Betsy, she done amazing. Like, she went up the hill, done fantastic. After I put her in four-wheel drive, like, she got everywhere I needed to go. So, anyways, this scenic route up through here is, like, the Rockwood Overlook. And you can see, like, different areas, like Kingston, Roan County, Spring City, um... The steam plants, Watts Bar. It's really nice. So, I was going to stay and watch the sunset, but I didn't because I wanted to get off the mountain before like the roads got even worse. Um, there they come. There goes the other people that were passing down the road i cracked myself up up here so once i got up there and was taking pictures and everything 
um here comes another one right through here but anyways i was taking pictures and as i was taking pictures i like stepped down in this one area and i fell onto my butt because like the snow was so deep and thick and i didn't realize it until like i hit bottom but uh, like i literally cracked myself up it was quite funny um i'm doing a voice over right on this because like i didn't realize going up the mountain i had the radio playing so yeah we don't need the radio going um but anyways i mean this is just so beautiful like it was way worth the drive um absolutely loved it it's even prettier in the snow whenever it snows it's like a whole different um i guess picture you would say um i don't do these voiceovers that well but like i said i didn't realize i had music going until i listened to the video and i was like well let's do a voiceover but here we're getting almost up to the mountain top here uh, where the star is. Uh, they typically light up the star every night. Um, and as you can see, we're getting up there close. Oh my gosh, look how deep this is. So deep. Ooh, it's cold. Hey y'all, so I'm back again with another sushi eating video from Kroger. So I went up on the mountain and so, okay, I was by myself and I went up to the star and then I went up to Ozone Falls and at the star so i was going to take pictures of like the overlook i kid you not the freaking snow was like this deep it went all the way up to my knees i fell hit my butt and i was like rolling i was laughing so hard i had so much fun so after burning all of those calories i was like hmm let's see if the kroger's is open actually i was gonna get a salad at the burger station and it was closed so i was like california row yes please so that's what I got. Also got opal a bone. And I also got two extra soy sauces. But y'all, oh my gosh, I had so much fun. And like, so as I was coming back down the mountain, they were like snow plows that were like on the road so like they were in front of me so I was coming behind them and I got to thinking and I was like you know um so yeah I just got a spicy California roll and it was $7.99 my face is red I don't have makeup on my face like the tone is a natural like pink color and plus I've been out in the cold so I don't have a drop of makeup on which is fine I don't care but anyways so as I was driving back from, or back down the mountain onto the overlook, I got to thinking, and like, I think this quite often, like, so we each have our part in the world. We each have our, our job. We each have a calling upon our lives that we do, whether it's if you're working at the convenience store, if you're working at the grocery store, if you're working at the doctor's office, the nursing home, you know, wherever that you may work, um, we have that position that we do. And to make the world go round, we have to each have our own field per se. And I was sitting there, hang on. Okay, so I was sitting there thinking. As to. Like. 
how much our roles play in our lives. Whether we're a doctor, a nurse, a CNA, a caregiver, uh, all of these things that we individually do. <clears throat> and at the end of the day, if you think about it, we all have a ordained calling. And then I'm thinking about jobs that people don't even like. Even even though they don't like them and say like they're miserable, which that's not a good scenario either. But even if they are miserable, they're still like doing a call by serving, like say if you're in a fast food checkout thing or cashier or, you know, like working at Walmart or all these things. And we each have those things in life. And as I was sitting and watching, like I'll do this vlog all together, but as I was sitting and watching like the snow plow, like making a way and plowing a way in front of me, and it was perfect timing, it was like, you know, I was up on the mountain, I was coming down the mountain, and then there he was. And I'm like, you know, like the Lord reminds me of things like that, and I'm like, you know, if this gentleman didn't have this job, and I'm assuming, you know, at times our jobs get hard, like our jobs get, um, what is the word I'm looking for? Competitive. Sometimes we get tired of our job because it's the same thing over and over. But whether it's plowing snow or picking up people's garbage, like I have a, a garbage that picks up this garbage company that picks up my garbage. Otherwise, I don't have anybody that could come get it. I have to pay an extra fee, which is okay. But I'm thinking, if I didn't have that, like... I would have to do it myself. And I guess what I'm getting at is we each have our own calling and we each have our own job. And sometimes we like we may not think that we're doing anything like in our job. But like that guy and he probably didn't think nothing of it. But that guy that was snowing, like plowing the snow in front of me, like he made the path clear for me and I'm like, that's awesome. And the Lord kind of like refreshed my mind and he's like, we each have a calling in life. Or we each have a job to do. And the whole wide world that we work in kind of comes into a circle of life, like the circle of life with everything. And I don't know, I was just thinking on that today. Do y'all ever think stuff like that? But. Like, For instance, what if we didn't have a doctor? What if we didn't have a nurse? What if we didn't have CNAs? What if we didn't have teachers? Like the world could not go round. Like I know I'm not ordained to be a teacher. Like that's not my calling, but there's people that have that calling and, you know, we each have our own individual calling. And if we didn't do that calling, then the world would be like in chaos. And I was just thinking that today. I'm like, you know, wow, how the world works. And I'm sure that guy probably didn't even think nothing about his job. But 
but for people that's not used to a snowstorm and then they're plowing it in front of you like I was so appreciative and I'm like you know I'm thankful for that snow plower So, sometimes, I guess my point of view is, I have my sushi up here on this. This is hot. Sometimes we don't think that we're appreciated, but we really are. Because like I said, it takes a lot to make the world go round. And if it wasn't for everyone linking together, doing what we do, doing what we like to do then this world would not be able to like go around and around like around and around we have preachers we have teachers we have singers and so forth. Woo, boy, these are hot. But I was just thinking that today. So good. But yeah, this redness is my natural face color. If I don't wear makeup, this is what you get. I don't know why. It might be like a mild thing of rosacea. I don't know. But my complexion is like a red tint. Which is okay. I mean, I don't care. I was not feeling putting on makeup today after I had my shower, so. Woo. There's really something spicy in these that are like very spicy. I love their sushi so much. It's so good. And I love these. I got those from Timu. And the only like downfall is that like my fingers are not completely like covered. But I kind of like it like this. They're nice.
watermelon pro pill. Yes, please. <clears throat> And then the last bit of sushi. So, it's starting to drizzle with like sleet, rain, snow, whatever. I'm literally just like three minutes down the road here. So, hope everybody's doing good. Until next time, guys, I will talk to you guys later. And thanks for watching. Bye.